Toronto too, Mayor! Hey, I'm gonna touch the team right away. Right away. Right away. Right away. <laughs> I have the honor of introducing our speakers today, and we will start today's ceremony with Councillor Gord Perks of Ward 14, Parkdale High Park. I invite all of our speakers to stand at the podium with Councillor Perks as he reads the proclamation and the rainbow flag is raised. Before, before the proclamation, I just wanted to say a couple of things. It is, it is uniquely and centrally human to want to love and be loved, to be intimate, to be romantic. That's part of who we are. It's also human to want to seek compassion, to seek community, to be part of society. Unfortunately, some people want to deny that compassion. They want to deny that community, whether it's through prudery or prurience or most likely just from fear. These feelings in our community lead to intolerance, lead to violence, lead to hurt. That's why it's always been such a delight for me to be able to come here and read the proclamation for our International Day Against Homophobia and Transphobia. It's particularly been important for me to be able to do that here with parents and friends of lesbians and gays who show that community begins with family and friendship, who show that our mission, our, mission, our task, isn't merely to accept or to tolerate, but to welcome with love into community all members of society. This year, uh, things are going to be a bit different than last year. I'm not going to read the proclamation. It's my distinct pleasure to invite Mayor Rob Ford up to read the proclamation against International Day. being here and taking part in this uh, absolutely fantastic day. I want to read out the proclamation. Day Against Homophobia and Transphobia in Toronto, May 17, 2012. Whereas the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedom recognizes that no discrimination shall be made on the bias, or I'm sorry, on the basis of a sexual orientation and gender identities. Toronto is a society open to everyone including the lesbian, gay, bisexual, transsexual, two-spirit, and transsexual LGBT community who are an important part of the city's diversity. Toronto is an active participant in the fight for elimination of all forms of discrimination and is committed to the equal treatment of all people and their right to live in conditions of dignity, respect, and peace. Now, therefore, I, Mayor Rob Ford, on behalf of Toronto City Council, to hereby claim May 17, 2012 as a day against homophobia and transphobia in Toronto and encourage the people of Toronto to send a strong message to the lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, two-spirited and transsexual communities, like, like all the communities are welcome, safe and valued in this great city we call Toronto. All the best, Mayor Rob Ford.
Wow, folks, how do you follow that? Yeah. 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 My name is Helen Kennedy. I'm the executive. Hey, 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 hey,